call anywhere where you feel most comfortable. How am I doing so far? Just fine. Okay, and you know, I seem all wired at home because I'm really excited. I, I just can't wait to be there. I know. Don't no, you worry, I'm going to be cool as a cucumber when the big day gets here. You will, huh? Yeah, I'm good to go right now. I got my backpack. I guess multiple rounds of the hospital all mapped out. I will be the picture of serenity. Why don't you start right now? Right, <laughs> You're underwater, looking out into the blue, blue ocean. You're in your cocoon. Cool, dark place. Maybe seven by nine feet.
when I saw you guys together. What? The night Mom got away from Eddie? I went to Annette's apartment. When I saw your car in the parking lot, I tried to tell myself that maybe you were there for something else, for some other reason. <laughs> and so I went up. And you know what I saw? I saw you all over her. And that's when I found out who you really were. A liar and a hypocrite. And you know what? You don't even deserve the Buchanan name. Whoa, Matthew. What on where on earth do you get off talking Mom, to your father like you don't, you don't, No, no, you don't, you don't leave. You apologize to your father right now. Dad first. Don't you worry about me. I'm not worried about you. I'm worried about Natalie. Oh, I'm not sure which is more stressful, getting ready for the baby or getting ready for the wedding. Uh, uh the baby. baby. Okay. I said almost. Well, you know, I understand. The closer we get to the wedding, you know, the more stuff I realize that we have to do. Well, why don't you ask me for an assist? Well, because you have a handful planning your own wedding. Oh, well, you know, I really haven't gotten a chance to think about it much with everything that's been going on. Really? I thought about it. Done anything wrong. Is that true, Dad? 
How long are you going to play her like a fool? I think she deserves to know. But I don't think you would care what you call it. I slept with the woman. These fights that you've been having. Didn't you tell me that you threw the Sam Rappaport thing in Nora's face? Well, she's going to think this is kind of payback. No. No? Can you trust our nets? What? Do you mean, is, is she going to tell? No, I don't think so. So what is the problem? That you telling Nora would just be easing your guilt. And you would probably end up hurting her and the marriage and what for? Matthew, what are you talking about? What is it that you think I have a right to know? That she's on you. With his assistance. Thank <laughs> you.